A Pennsylvania bill to stop the use of cell phones while driving is moving forwards and backwards at the same time. A last minute amendment during Wednesday's House vote could change how police officers enforce the new law. Eyewitness News reporter Cody Butler joins us live in Scranton to explain. Cody. Mark, good evening. The way it stands right now, if House Bill 37 passes, law enforcement will not be able to pull someone over solely on being solely having them be on their cell phone, which is raising a lot of frustration among those who are fighting to hold motorists accountable. In the past five years in the state, drivers using cell phones have accounted for more than 5,500 crashes, according to PennDOT, nearly 50 of them fatalities. The amendment prohibits the use of an interactive wireless communication device, a cell phone while a person is operating a motor vehicle on a highway or traffic way. Representative Rosemary Brown introduced House Bill 37 nearly a year ago. At Wednesday's vote in Harrisburg, the bill passed. Minutes later, State Representative Doyle Hefley introduced an amendment that would move the handheld ban from a primary offense to a secondary offense. If you're distracted and looking away, dialing a phone or texting, that's distracted driving. And if you get in an incident or an accident because of it, you're going to be cited for it. As a mother who has lost her child, you don't want somebody to get a citation after the fact or a summary offense after the fact. 21-year-old Paul Miller Jr. died in July of 2010 as a result of a truck driver who was on his cell phone. Since then, Eileen has been working with Brown to make Pennsylvania drivers more accountable. We have totally reversed the law and actually it's going to make it worse. The 20 other plus states that have this legislation do have it as a primary and there's a reason for that. Representative Brown says with the bill as it stands heading to the Senate, drivers will not be able to touch the phone while driving. It can be in a docking position and be used. But we're getting the phone out of the driver's hand, so that's really a very good piece of it. Now, as the bill stands right now, it will be a summary offense and a $150 fine and no points on a driver's license. If the Senate votes to approve the bill as it stands right now, it will go to Governor Wolf's desk to be signed into law. If there are no changes, it will, or if there are changes, it will go back to the House. In Scranton, Cody Butler, Eyewitness News. We'll follow the progress on that, Cody. Thanks.